Arizona State's 85-67 loss to Arizona on Wednesday night in the final Pac-12 game that would be played in Tempe can be described the same as their recent past in the conference. Not enough to get over the hump. Arizona's physical play that kept the Sun Devils away from the basket and settling for jump shots that they couldn't convert allowed the number six team in the country to build a lead by as many as 18. Too much for ASU's comeback attempt to overcome. Um, but to be honest, like Arizona is is better than we are right now. You know, and that's, uh, you know, we certainly uh, cut it to six a couple times, four one time, I believe, we just never, could, could put enough game pressure on them or get it to where we you know, had a lead and where we just we got close, but we could not could get over the hump. The two schools that are off to the Big 12 are simply in two different places at this point in time. For the Sun Devils, it was a season of setbacks, while their neighbors in Tucson will try to compete for a national championship. You know, when you fight, and you're not going to win everything, but me personally, it's, it's the way you lose, you know what I'm saying? It's the way you go about life and take your L's. And, you know, a couple shots here and there, could win in, better start, you know, but the effort was there for the most part, so you can't beat, your, beat yourself up too much, but you want to win most of the game, so. As the Pac-12 chapter of Arizona State men's basketball nears its close, the Devils will head to Vegas one final time. And as Bobby Hurley said earlier this season, who knows how anyone's supposed to feel. At Desert Financial Arena, Ben Paris, Cronkite Sports.